In Informatica Developer, you can preview data. In this demo, we will preview data in a physical data object, preview data midstream in a transformation, customize the data preview options, and export the output data that we previewed. We can see a mapping open in the editor. The mapping joins data from two sources. The read unique customer source contains the first and last name of each customer, and the read sales transaction source does not. The purpose of this mapping is to add the first and last names of each customer to a list of sales transactions. Now we can use the data viewer view to preview the data in the read sales transactions object. Preview the data to ensure that the source contains the data that we want to transform. Click Run to preview the data. The Data Integration Service reads the data and it displays the output in the Data Viewer view. The data looks correct. Next, let's preview data midstream in a transformation. We want to preview the Joiner transformation to make sure it is joining the data correctly. You can also right-click an object to preview data. In the editor, right-click the Joiner Customer's Sales Transformation and select Run Data Viewer. The Data Integration Service reads the data and it displays the output in the Data Viewer view. The first name and last name of each customer does not appear when we preview the data of the Joiner Transformation. Let's modify the ports that appear in the output. Click Choose and select the ports that appear. All of the ports are selected by default. Move the ports from the selected column to the available column. Select Customer Number, First Name, Last Name, and Payment Description. Move these ports to the selected column and click OK. The results appear in the Output window. Notice that the customer number, first name, last name, and payment description are the only ports that appear in the output. We can now see that the joiner transformation is joining the data correctly. You can create a custom configuration to control the settings that the developer tool applies when you preview data. Let's preview the data in the joiner transformation with a custom configuration. Click Run then open Run Dialog to create a Data Viewer configuration. In the Run Configurations dialog box, select Data Viewer Configuration, then click the New button to create a configuration. You can specify how many rows and characters you want to see in the output. You can also specify default date time format, override the tracing level, and set the sort order and optimizer level. In this demo, we want to set the maximum number of rows to display in the results to 100. Click Apply when you are finished creating the configuration. Click Run. The results appear in the Data Viewer view. Notice that 100 rows appear in the results. Now, let's export the data from the Joiner transformation to a file so that a local copy of the data will be stored for reference. You can export the data that displays in the output window to a tab delimited file such as a TXT or CSV file. In the Data Viewer view, right click the results and select Export Data. Select the location where you want to save the file and add a TXT or CSV extension to the file name. Then click Save. The Developer tool includes a cheat sheet that explains how to preview data. Click Help, then click Cheat Sheets, and select the cheat sheet called Preview Data. That completes this demo. To summarize, we previewed data in a physical data object, previewed data midstream in a transformation, created a custom configuration for previewing data, and exported data. If you have feedback on this demo or to request a demo on another topic,
Email us at infa underscore documentation at informatica.com. You can also tweet us on the Infa Support Twitter site.